East is 90 degrees and West is 270 degrees. And we believe that Sun always rises from East and sets in the West. But that is not the case. I have selected a place in Sumatra which is almost on the equator. In the month of December, the sun is rising from 113 degree and setting at 247 degree. That is 27 degrees off from actual east and west. In the month of June, again, the sun rises from 67 degree and sets at 293 degree. Again, 23 degrees off. Does this ring any bell? Earth's rotational axis is tilted by about 23.5 degrees with respect to its orbital plane. On 10th December, the southern half of the Earth is max tilted towards the Sun. So the Sun rises from southeast and sets in southwest. This is summer in southern hemisphere and winter in northern hemisphere. But around March 20th, the sun rises from true east on 90 degree and sets at true west or 270 degree. The same thing happens around 21 or 22nd September. The sun rises from 90 degrees and sets at 270 degrees. Around 10th December, the sun appears to move from southern sky towards north. In India, this is also known as Uttarayan or the Northern Journey. The December solstice happens sometimes between December 20 and 21, when the sun is directly over the Tropic of Capricorn in the Southern Hemisphere. Around 20th March, sun appears to cross the equator from south. This is known as March Equinox. In Northern Hemisphere, March Equinox is also known as the Spring or Vernal Equinox. Equinox word derived from Latin meaning equal night. This day, the length of day and night is same. Around 10th June, the sun stops moving north and appears to start moving towards south again. In India, this is known as Dakshinayan or southern journey. The June solstice happens around 20th or 21st June when the sun is directly over the tropics of Cancer in northern hemisphere. Around 21-22nd September the sun is again directly on the equator and appears to cross towards the south. This is known as September equinox. In northern hemisphere this is known as autumnal equinox. And the saga continues. If you are interested, you can visit timeanddate.com website to learn more. The dates that are shown here are for the people living between tropics line either side of the equator. If you are living north and south of the tropics line and close to Arctic or Antarctic circle, then the movement of the sun will be completely different. And that can be a subject of a different video. I hope you enjoyed this video. Stay curious and ask questions. See you around.